A neap tide is when we have really low high tides and really high low tides, okay? So with that being said, the sun, the earth, and the moon is at 90 degree angles. So that means the moon is pulling on the earth's surface like this, oh man, right? And then the sun is pulling on the earth's surface like this. And that's what it's gonna look like. Now the moon gravitational pull is stronger than the sun. So you'll have the high tide this side, okay? We're looking at the North Pole and we are right here. So right now we're at high tide because we're closest to the moon as opposed to the sun. So high tide, it's gonna rotate every six hours. Then you get to low tide and that low tide is going to be a pretty high low tide, higher than average because we have now the sun's gravitational pull. Six hours later, back to high tide. And then six hours later, back to low tide. So there, it averages out. So you have a really low high tide and a really high low tide there. So that's what you call a neap tide. So that means the range, the tidal range, is shorter compared to the tidal range with a spring tide, which may be larger. So let's say this is high in a uh, spring tide, this is low in a, a spring tide. And this is high in a neap tide, low in a neap tide. So that range changes depending on the position of the sun, moon, and the earth. Okay, and there's of course a middle middle ground. Let's say when the moon is right here. Okay, that means it'll be about somewhere in between the high and the low, spring and neap.